Established in 1976, Designed Mouldings is a specialist in injection moulding, producing plastic caps and seals for customers in the packaging industry and for big multinational companies including Unilever, Johnson & Johnson and Procter & Gamble. Based in Caringbar, New South Wales, Designed Mouldings has 18 moulding machines and 40 employees. The company primarily serves Australia and also exports to Eastern Europe and Southeast Asia. The company witnessed a spike in orders during COVID-19 as border closures meant more companies were sourcing their products locally. Challenged with the sudden rise in demand, Designed Mouldings looked for an effective solution to automate their processes and increase their productivity. We had sort of production volumes of caps like this uh, were sort of between the 10 and 20,000 a month. And then all of a sudden they wanted between 50 and 100,000 a month. And it was a, a very manual operation. We had to pick up a wad, put it down in there, stamp it down with a, a tool. So we decided the way to do it was to automate the process. So we reached out to the guys at Australis Engineering and their recommendation was to use a VGC-10 on-robot gripper with the TechMam robot. It had unlimited customization to fit various needs. It was able to be deployed very fast. It was uh, very small, lightweight and ideal to fit into a small, a very small space. So the gripper doesn't require any uh, external air supply, reduces the maintenance costs, and makes for much faster deployment. So you can see with the collaborative robot, it works safely alongside employees without the need of a safety fence. The machine's got such a small footprint, it can be plugged in anywhere. For this application, we recommended they pick the end effector first as it's an integral part of the automation solution. The robot arm is like a human arm with the end effector being like a human hand. The arm can move, but it needs the hand or the end effector in order to do the job. The selected solution was the on-robot VGC-10. It delivers a flexible automation solution that can be redeployed to multiple tasks. As a contract manufacturer with a wide range of orders and varying products, this flexibility was very important to design mouldings. The on-robot VGC-10 gripper is used to automate the sealing of wads on plastic caps. Wads are used to seal containers and protect their contents from deterioration or contamination through exposure to air, moisture or other impurities. Setting up the VGC-10 gripper was fairly quick. It only took us three to four days to install and integrate it with the cobot and then to program and deploy the collaborative application. Australis Engineering gave us guidance with the task, but we're pretty much able to do most of it ourselves just because of the on-robot VGC-10 simplicity and ease of use. And we've had other assembly lines that's taken us weeks to put together and this only took us three to four days. This means we don't have to be sitting here or standing here all day putting these two pieces together. We can let the gripper do the work and that's freed us up to do more important jobs. The shift from manual hand assembly to collaborative automation has helped designed mouldings shorten the production cycle time, increase productivity and maintain consistent output quality. So the gripper can do about 20,000 per day, which is triple what we were doing in, a, in the manual process. We're finding now that our wastage is down between one and 2% due to the operators not dropping caps, etc., on the floor. We're now able to cope with our increase in production orders without putting a pressure on our current workforce. We're hoping to get a return on investment in about six months. With the successful implementation of the collaborative application with the VGC-10, Paul and his son Daniel are keen to look at automating more applications in the factory. We're very happy with the collaborative application of using the VGC-10 on-robot gripper and the TechMan cobot. We're already looking into implementing other collaborative applications and we're looking at using the uh, on-robot RG2 gripper, which is a finger gripper to put together a hospital filter and a, and a little adapter. We're a leading injection moulding company in Australia, so staying competitive is really important. The collaborative application through on-robot will help us remain competitive and secure our future.